Now we often talk about data products and what businesses can do with their data, but how can data actually be used to improve the customer experience? Well, first of all, customers themselves have really changed uh, in the way that they interact with businesses. I think they need the idea that the, you understand something about what they're looking for. Uh, so if you provide underneath your platform a connection to the data that they're interested in, I think that really enriches the interaction. So it's becoming a, a pretty important part of business, I think, to, to connect data to the, to the people that are coming in the door. Now, should be, businesses be using data to serve customers at the individual level? I mean, can it get that granular? Uh, it's best when it is, and I think people are becoming very accustomed to that. In particular, in a mobile world, you know, if you're actually dynamic and you're changing, I think what, what you have to look at is what the customer is actually doing, what they're experiencing. So again, data is a part of life. If, if they're actually using data to get to you, then you better be using data to connect to them as well. Are there analytics that apply specifically to customer interaction? Are there things that businesses should be looking for? Yeah, I think there are models. Again, uh, you know, if you first start with a profile of who you're dealing with, you know, what it is that that, that that customer represents to you, they may be first of all an existing customer. They may be spending five dollars a month with you for some reason, but I think it's important for you to also then be able to recognize what they might represent to you. So, if they're spending five dollars with you now, maybe they could spend three hundred or six hundred dollars with you a month. You need to understand those people who are going to be that way. Uh, so I think loyalty analytics is, is one area that's very interesting in that regard. Um, and I think where we, in the past you might have looked at what is causing customers to leave. I think now you can look at what will keep customers coming back and, and in fact move them along a trajectory that, that corresponds to their particular demographic or what kind of person they are. Last question for you. Do things like serendipity and agility have a place in data analytics? Yeah. Serendipity and timing. Uh, I think agility is uh, the ability to, to recognize serendipity and again react to that. Mm. Uh, so I think if you're if you're talking about uh, how you interact, dynamic uh, interactions and machine learning really are very important in recognizing those opportunities and getting a, a product that might otherwise have not even been part of that interaction brought to bear for that interaction. All right. Well, thanks so much for being with us. Appreciate you, you taking the time. My pleasure.